hello guys if this is your first time of watching my youtube videos please do well to subscribe so that whenever i publish a new video you will be the first person to get notification please don't forget to click on the red button to subscribe in our today's tutorial we are going to talk on how to install python anaconda and spider so open your google browser type in download download python so let's see so you can see it here download python so let's choose download python okay here we are going to select the particular version of python that we want to download so let's see the highest version of python now is 3.8 so let's click let's click on python 3.8 okay so here we have different version of python 3.8 then we have 3.7 we have okay the next thing you're going to do is to click on download then choose the one that suits your computer if you're using window choose windows if you're using mac you choose mac so let me choose windows so here i have different version of python with different computers so I'm going to choose the one that suits my so let me choose Python 3.82 so I'm going to choose download Windows 86 64 so I'm my computer is 64 bit so I'm going to download this one so if your computer is also 32 bit you are still going to download this one so if this mark you can search for mark so let's download windows at 64 executable installer then you can see my python 3.82 has started downloading so the next thing i'm going to do is is to download anaconda so here i'm going to write google so type in download anaconda so the first one select anaconda python distribution free download so here you are going to select the one that suits your computer if you are using windows you, se you select windows if you are using mac os or linux you select the one that suits you so i'm going to select window version so here i'm going to select 3.7 because i'm not i'm not going to use 2.7 so here the highest version here is python 3.7 so i'm going to download for python 3.7 so my computer is 64 bit graphical installer so i'm going to choose this one that is 64 bit if you are using 32 bit you choose 32 bit so let me choose this one So you can see that my anaconda has started downloading so let me see my python so there is one interesting thing here is that in order to use this anaconda we are going to download python 3.7 so 
you have to go back again to download 3.7 i'm not going to download 3.7 because i have already have python 3.7 so let me show you how you're going to install this python that is 3.8 it's the same process it's the same process so what you are going to do is to click on the your what you have downloaded then click on install now then you can see that the the python has started installing the installation has begun so what you are going to do is just go back again and download python 3.7 version i'm not going to download it because i have, i have already have python 3.7 on my computer so you can see that 3.8 is already downloading okay so the installation has finished so what you are going to do is to close it then let's wait for anaconda to finish downloading okay so the anaconda has been downloaded so what you are going to do is to open the part okay you can see our anaconda tray so let's click on it okay so you can see it welcome to anaconda 2020 so click next then agree then choose just for me because you are you are the only person that want to use it then click next choose the part that you want to install your anaconda then click next then click okay choose the place you want to install it directory user anaconda is not empty please choose a different location okay because i've already have one anaconda in my system so it's asking me to choose another location so i'm going to install it okay see what i'm going to do let me choose another location so from the pc maybe this one yeah. okay make a new folder and call it anaconda anaconda 2020 okay so let me install so here add anaconda to my path environment variable you can choose to add then register anaconda as my default python 3.7 of course you can see okay eventually okay because i've i've already have one anaconda in my system so i'm going to leave this one open but if you haven't installed anaconda before you can choose to click on it so i'm going to install
okay the installation has finished so what you are going to do now is to open the anaconda so let's type anaconda so i'm going to choose anaconda navigator 2020 so let's open it it's going to take some time before it's open okay you can see that the anaconda has opened so the next thing i'm going to do is to click on environment then create new environment so from here i'm going to click on create so i'm going to choose the name that suits me for example let me select hello world hello world I, that is going to be my new environment so i'm going to choose the python so here you can see because i've already installed python 3.7 so i'm going to choose python 3.7 so Python 3.8 is not going to work on Anaconda. So you're going to install Python 3.7, not 3.8. So here I'm going to create. It's going to take a while to create a new environment so after the creation of this environment wow so you can find out that we have succeeded in creating a new environment called hello world so the next thing we are going to do is to install spider so from here go to home then install spider you can see spider here so what you are going to do is to install spider so finally we were able to install spider IDE. So the next step here is to click on the launch button to launch Spider. So let's launch Spider. You can see the Spider is about to load. Wow. So you can see the environment here the spider has loaded so okay the next thing we're going to do here is to type some code so let's type some code on, on the environment for example i'm going to say that maybe s s is equals to let me use hello world hello what hello what let me make the w capital so hello what then the next thing i'm going to do i'm going to write print x so let's run the program and see the answer click on the run button and execute the program wow you can see it from here from the output hello world so in this tutorial we were able to download python 
anaconda and a spider we are able to install them and we are able to do all the necessary settings that are involved so in our next tutorial i'm going to teach you how to install some libraries like OpenCV, NumPy, Matplot Library, and so on. So, see you guys in the next tutorial. Thank you very much for your time. Do it to have a wonderful day. Bye.